Mm-hmm. Is there anything you'd like to say to mm-hmm. so many people that watched the video with you and they really? <laughs> and, uh, you ready? Yeah. Look, Robbie, welcome back, man. Thanks, thanks. Look, I wasn't expecting to see you. This was a total shock. I just literally just got out here and I just saw you sitting on the bench. Yep. Mm-hmm. So, okay, so. So what? So did you check out the video, the one that we did a, a month and a half ago? Yes, I did. Actually. Okay, um, hold on, hold on. First, hold on. I didn't mean to cut you off, but first, off, how how have you been doing? I'm doing well. Yeah. It's been tiring. Yesterday was a busy day. Today was kind of light, so yeah. I'm scheduled to go to Cebu tomorrow. Okay. So how long have you been back back here in Dumaguete? Um, I was. I came from Bacolod yesterday. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I left early in the morning, 5 a.m. Then via Mabinai, from Mabinai, from store to store to start to check on my product. Wow, you're really going from store to store to store to yes, check on your... to check the display, to check if they're, 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 they're out of stocks or what. Hardworking guy, yeah. man. I respect that. Yeah, yeah. You're, you're, really, you're really going from store to store. So, uh, okay. I'm glad you're, you've been doing good, man. Uh, so, okay. So... So you checked up on the video. Yes. Okay. And what, what did you think about it, man? What, what is your, how do you feel? I don't know where to. <laughs> well, actually, I'll tell you something. Um, I didn't tell anyone about the video. I didn't tell anyone about the, the, the interview. Yeah. Uh, I just got a text. I saw your video, you're popular. One after another. Yeah. Then my church meet, he texted me too, and he doesn't text me at all. Yeah. So then then my family my daughter they saw it all so i'm kind of proud okay. you should be proud man sorry oh it's okay and a leader yeah 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 you should be proud you know like uh you definitely should be proud were you expecting that kind of reaction no 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 no, no? i thought there won't be much viewers yeah so i didn't expect that they will know about it yeah so when they knew about it, I felt shy of it. <laughs> Did yeah. they do good? Did they do well? Look, you you were you you know was what? Was my I, grammar correct? <laughs> you 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 were yourself, and yeah. you know I think that's what uh what a lot of people love about it, mm-hmm. man. You know, like uh, yeah. So, well, like I said, man, I wasn't even expecting to see you down here. Uh, how how longer? How much longer are you going to be here? I'm leaving tomorrow. Oh, you're leaving tomorrow? Uh, I, always, I, I always catch you. I always catch you when you're leaving the next morning. Yes. Yeah. How's, <laughs> your, how's your polar bear product going? Oh, it's doing well, but um, school is ending. So usually when the school is ending, the sales goes a little bit down. Yeah. But the acceptance is good. It's yeah. really good. Well, I'm glad that that's doing good. You know, you taught me something, you know, like uh, when we when you first told uh, when we were first talking, uh, I went back and I checked it, Pakiki Sama. Yeah. You know, when you first said that word, it was kind of like a tongue twister for me. But now I'll know it for the rest of my life. Do you know the English term of that, Pakiki Sama? Well, a lot of people commented. Did you read the comment? You said not all. No, <laughs> not all. You got to check. Maybe them one out. or two comments. I, I might go through that. Well, you're a busy man. Maybe you don't have. I'm always night. on the wheel. I'm, uh, I drive, so. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So and I got a lot, I get a lot of message for work related. So, yeah, well, there's a lot of there's so many kind people that, you know, that they uh, they, they said what Pakiki Sama means. Mm-hmm. Uh, you also mentioned it, but a lot of people also and they say that it means uh, like uh, camaraderie or compa- uh, companionship, I believe, um, okay. bro- uh, like uh, a, a sense of togetherness, something like that. How would you describe it? Well, uh, it's how to get along with them, okay. how to blend. How to, bl- yeah. to blend, yeah. blend in, blending in. Yeah, and you feel like, well, obviously, you feel like you've blended in perfectly. Yeah, because I know the language, culture, etc. Yeah. And actually, if I meet Filipino, they, I mean, people that I don't know, and I start talking to them in Tagalog, and sometimes they're shocked that I understand Visaya or Ilongo. Yeah. They kind of... <laughs> Um, like they're amazed, so yeah, um, that's how I make friends. <laughs> it's, it's easy for you to make friends. I, I imagine so, right? Like it was easy for me to to uh, talk to you. I mean, I didn't even know you. I just walk up to you. You're such a nice, friendly guy, man. Uh, it's true. 
Do you remember the last time that we talked? Uh, I think uh, we had a challenge about playing pool. Everybody yes, said, yes. everybody said, don't challenge Robbie because he's Filipino and he's gonna, and the Filipino is easily gonna beat me, huh? Are you well? well um, like, like, be like for me, some with the game. Yeah. If sometimes you're good, you really get really good. I mean, I'm in shock with myself. Yeah. But then if you are bad, you're, you know, <laughs> like believe me, there was a place in Metro Manila. I got the chance to play with Efren and 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 the other guy, the Jangas, the the Danga, or something like that. Yeah. So, well, I was able to beat him by chance, by chance. Maybe he gave me a shot, then I finished the ball. <laughs> so that was my peak, yeah. but now it's gone. <laughs> so, so you the so jungle, you're, the jungle, yeah. The jungle, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So you, so, so basically, you're telling me, oh, don't challenge your pool, don't bet no money because I will lose. No, no, I, I'm not that hustler. I'm not that hustler. You're not that hustler. Yeah. You know the yeah, hustler. Yeah. The hustler always goes in. And they, they yeah, look Yeah, I know what you mean, but yeah. no, not me. Yeah, not you. <laughs> they huh? pretend they don't know much, yeah. and yeah, then they're really great. They're yeah, like the first game, they lose. Yes. Maybe the second game, they lose. And, but by, I don't bet. I don't like betting. You don't bet? But sometimes, sometimes, like, there was this guy, he was kind of, like, uh, rude to others, and he was losing. He was not a good player at all, yeah. and he wanted to bet. Like 100 pounds per game. So I said, okay, fine. Yeah. And I keep on winning. Yeah. <laughs> he gave up. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Well, look, man, it's, you know what? It's great bumping into you. And uh, I don't know, what were you just out here hanging out, just chilling? Relaxing, yeah. Just relaxing? Yeah, yeah. Well, I, like, I'm planning to sleep early tonight. Then um, I'm looking for somewhere to eat, and I have not decided yet. Have you eaten at the Why Not over there? Why Not? Yeah, I think uh, that's a good place. Well... What kind of food do you like? Actually, I ate too much of Inasal in Bacolod. <laughs> a lot of Inasal? Food. Like Inasal. Uh, Manok? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's so good. That's though. the best place in Bacolod. But you know where do I eat in Bacolod? On the streets. On the streets? Yeah, because um, one guy brought me to a place. <laughs> I've been to all of the restaurants that sell. Yeah. Um, then this guy told me to try the inasal here. What he did is told the 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 lady make it slow, yeah. cook it slow, and he then they put some labuyo on it. Yeah. And turned out really great, man. I'm shocked. I ate four pesos. Four. <laughs> four. Yes. four pesos. Wow. So I go back there all the time. You know, I'm curious because you, because you you live up in Manila. What what's your favorite food up in Manila? Okay, because like I asked you that because here in Cebu, they're in Cebu they're known for the lechon. I yes. guess you say in Bacalo they're known for the inasal. Yeah. What what what's your, what what is your go? to I told you in my interview before I love Indian food. Okay. Yeah. I, there's a lot of uh, oh, Indian restaurant in in Manila, so I get to order all the time. Sometimes I tell my wife to cook. She knows she's a Filipina, but she learned from my mom before. <laughs> and my sister is there. Sometimes, you know, you get tired of your wife's cooking. You try yeah. to tell someone else to cook, so yeah. something different. What is your, did you, does your wife know about the video? Did she see the video? Um, she knows, but she didn't comment on that. She didn't comment on it. She should be proud of you, man. You know what? <laughs> Honestly, you're a great guy. Well, you're well, a great guy, man. That's what it is. You're like, you're like you're just like one of those guys that like how could how could somebody not love this guy you know and plus yeah like that you know but usually first impression with me they they say that i'm um what you call this masungit Mas masungit means um how do you like grumpy or something not normal grumpy grumpy is uh, um not friendly so uh, well your first impression is not friendly well you know we're older okay i've got not grumpy that old not uh, grumpy old like not friendly they look at me and they think that i'm not friendly something uh, like that maybe because uh i don't know but but that's not true at all man you're like uh you're like super nice yeah like like they say that i have a serious face yeah some people say that about me too yeah <laughs> yeah. yeah some people have but a when they get to know me then that's the time that oh, yeah he's yeah. a going guy well, look, man. Uh, I hope I didn't. I hope I didn't disturb you because you said you're out here relaxing. No, and, no, uh, not at all. Actually, I was thinking maybe I would see you again here and just say hi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. I, it happened. <laughs> yeah. 
But look, man, uh, I don't know. Let's, I guess we'll end the video and uh, and let's do some relaxing, man. I, you can, I don't know. Is it cool if I hang out with you for a few yeah, minutes? Yeah, sure, sure not. I love that. No. All right, man. Well, let's, uh, all right, man. Is there anything you'd like to say to mm. so many people that watched the video with you and they really... Yeah, sure. Um, I would like to thank everyone for the comments. It's good that there's no bashers. Yeah. Um, salam sa inyo lahat. And I'm kind of proud that 1 million views and you did a good job. Thanks, man. Mm. I appreciate it. And you did a great job. And it's all you. You, you know. So, uh, and we love the Philippines, right? And I'm trying to learn Visaya. Slowly by slowly, I'm learning Visaya. Yeah. Well, I know I'm married to a Visaya. I understand her sometimes, but some, but I could not speak, but I'm gonna try. Yeah, that's great, Maybe man. a year from now, I'll be good in Visaya. <laughs> well, you know, to, if you, you, well, you're fluent in Tagalog, oh, yeah. so it probably is easier for you to learn Visaya than me. You know, Kabaloko, uh, Jutai. Saktolang. Saktolang, okay. Yeah. Kamay, or Jutai. <laughs> <laughs> I get confused, it's Ilongo and Visaya. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're great, man. I love you, man. All right, well, let's hang out some. All right. All right.